taking me straight to the tropics and I think you will like it. I feel like Imperia Fragrances had me in mind when they created this fragrance because it smells so much like the tropics. As soon as I spread this on, I felt like it was the perfect fragrance to use during summer. It is tropical, it's sweet, it's juicy, but mostly juicy. I love that like on the highest level. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Charlene for those of you who are new and to my loyal subscribers, thank you as always for coming back. I had the opportunity to work with a black owned niche fragrance house. I'm going to tell you guys all about this exciting new fragrance by Imperia Fragrances, which is a niche house and a black owned niche house to be exact. So they reached out to me a few weeks ago. They asked me if I wanted to check out the perfume. Now, if you've been watching my videos for a while, you know that I have quite a few fragrances. So before committing to any type of partnership with them, I wanted to really test out the fragrance for myself, see how I felt about it. In my very first communication with them, they were so transparent. They wanted my full, honest review. And you guys know, I'm gonna keep it real, okay? So of course I told him I would try it. I did not want to come into a partnership without knowing what the fragrance was like, but oh my goodness. When I did the first spray on this fragrance, I was blown away. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know that I featured this a few days ago and it is so beautiful. I will show you guys shortly. I feel like Imperia Fragrances had me in mind when they created this fragrance because it smells so much like the tropics. It reminds me of the islands like totally fit for an island girl like myself so so the whole partnership was almost like written in the stars you know so anyway the fragrance is the very first fragrance that they're launching it's called ocean v so the fragrance comes in this box it has some information at the back it tells you about the inspiration of the fragrance it has the notes on the side i do like gold a lot so i was immediately intrigued by this this is what the fragrance looks like ocean v it's very sleek very clean for a new niche house with only one fragrance i feel like the packaging is really nice so one of the things i enjoy most is this spray y'all look at this the mist on it is beautiful to me like this was a burst of the tropics when i first sprayed this as i talked through my experience with this fragrance i will Tell you guys, of course, what I think about it. We'll talk about longevity and performance and all of that. And I will just list the notes down here for you guys so y'all can follow along. So I wore it a few times, but then I tested it out for real for a full day wear test. And I had some observations. I took notes. I have my computer in front of me. I will start off first by just saying that the note composition is very beautiful, um, especially those tropical notes. Like I love the coconut milk. I love the mango. And everything else makes it very, very unique. While it's very tropical, it's not like intense, if that makes sense. It's like the perfect summer fragrance. That's my opinion of this. And you could reapply as often as you want. Now, some people hate reapplying and that's fine. And some people will reapply all day and that's fine too. The intensity of this fragrance will last, I would say, strongly about three to four hours and then after that it becomes a skin sense if you like getting the full effect of your fragrance during the day you will have to reapply this i'm just gonna say it right off the bat i'm just thinking of ice juice drinks <laughs> just just the tropical vibe for real the inspiration for this fragrance is the goddess ocean orisha ocean basically the whole idea is to embrace your inner strengths because every woman has like unlimited capacity to do whatever she wants i love that like on the highest level <laughs> i love that it embraces personal growth and self-awareness and all of that so that part of it is just totally like i'm here for it but again like i mentioned perfect for summer the notes are very very beautiful the lasting power not the greatest but if you do not mind reapplying it, then definitely try this out. If you want to support a black owned niche fragrance house, you definitely need to try this out. I will link the website down below so you all can definitely go there. There's only one fragrance launch. So like I said, they're very new, very small. 
but don't let that stop you from trying an amazing fragrance so that kind of covers everything i have to share with you guys about ocean v by imperial fragrances if you want like some type of reference point not that they smell the same, but the light composition of it and everything about it. So it reminds me of L'Imperatrice by Dolce & Gabbana. Not that they smell the same, y'all, but that juiciness, because I think L'Imperatrice has like that watermelon um, note. This one has that juicy mango mixed with those other beautiful notes, mandarin and bergamot, etc. So it kind of brings me there, but they do not smell the same. That's just like reference point. It is vibrant. It is beautiful. It is mouth watering good. Thank you as always for watching. If you have any questions, don't forget to put them below. Check out Imperial Fragrances on Instagram as well as their website, which I'll link down below. And as always, thank you so much for stopping by. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.